After meeting with Vladimir Zelensky at the Royal Palace, Queen Letizia made another public appearance at the finals of the scientific monologue competition. After Vladimir Zelensky's visit, King Felipe, 56, and Queen Letizia, 51, continued their official agenda separately. The king went to celebrate the 25th anniversary of the Euro-America Foundation, while the queen presided over the finals of the Solo de Ciencia scientific monologue competition, which aims to attract and train researchers to popularize science from the earliest stages of its development. Their Professional Careers this annual event celebrates scientific excellence and innovation, honoring the achievements of renowned scientists and researchers. Queen Letizia showed up at the Circulo de Bellas Arts in Madrid dressed more casually than usual. Taking advantage of the warm weather in Madrid, the Spanish sovereign wore an original all-white summer outfit consisting of white pants, a flowing white sleeveless top with an interesting interplay of white and cream fabric overlays by Adolfo Dominguez and a pair of white sneakers by Vivo Barefoot Geocord 3, her most favorite pair of shoes lately after having to give up heels completely due to a serious foot injury. A very original look that is easy to stand out in, but not too extravagant. It's not the first time we've seen this modern design blouse, the first time it was worn at the ARCO Madrid International Contemporary Art Fair. After it became known about the illness of her right foot, resulting from a domestic accident, the Queen's work uniform has been replaced by sneakers or, since yesterday, new ballet flats, which for obvious reasons were a first for her. Of the accessories, Queen Letizia chose a Massimo Dutti wicker bag in the same color and fine gold jewelry from the El Haja cult store. The Spanish sovereigns, who are to celebrate their 10th year on the throne, are preparing to appear on May 30 at the first meeting of the Royal Board of Directors of the Royal Collection Gallery.